Are you looking for a better lunch? Find out how you can get healthy, interesting, and convenient food options at work when we come back. Plastic bottles make you nauseous. Using public transportation's awesome. Solar powered everything. No cell phone, just cups and strings. You make your t-shirts out of grass. You kick the cars that guzzle gas. Understand. Use cartons, man. Be a Tetra Pak fan. Finding interesting, inexpensive, and convenient lunch options when you're in the middle of a busy workday can be tough, which is why two young entrepreneurs decided it was time for a change and came up with an innovative solution, Leanbox. So Leanbox is basically, um, it's really trying to solve sort of an age old problem, uh, which is access to healthy food. So in the corporate food service world, traditionally you've had sort of two buckets that you can pull from. One, you have vending machines, chips, soda, candy. And then on the other end of the spectrum, you have these massive cafeterias. They're not really feasible for the majority of the market. So companies that are under a thousand people. So in short, that's what Leanbox is. Leanbox is the portal to have healthy, fresh, natural food sort of where you want it, when you want it for offices that are um, you know, smaller than a thousand people. Uh, I worked in a, a nine to five or, you know, really what is it these days? It's eight to six or seven to seven um, type environment. And we were a smaller office. We didn't have a big corporate cafeteria where we could go down and get lunch. And, you know, days are busy. It's, it's no longer work-life balance. It's work-life blend. What initially started this whole journey for us was we're not health nuts, but we wanted access to healthy, cool, unique food, and we just didn't have it in our own offices. So we thought there's gotta be a better way to do this. And for the founders of Leanbox, it's not just about convenience. It's about seeking out and offering up some of the most innovative foods. The big thing for us, just in terms of, you know, sort of categorically is, is getting stuff into the machine that is maybe slightly ahead of the market. So best example for that, if uh, coconut water is really starting to take hold, as uh, you know, sort of a standard product that people know of that they're aware of, but you know, maybe maple water and artichoke water is something that could turn someone's eye at a corporate office. So Leanbox is always trying to sort of push the barrier a little bit, really introduce people to stuff that they otherwise uh, may not have heard of and may not be mainstream. The other uh, version of that is, is sort of introducing food startups that don't have mass market. So for example, we worked with two local Northeastern students that were doing an edible coffee. That was a really, really cool product, but you know, they're not in the big grocery chains yet. They're not in, in any chain store. And we can sort of take their product and quickly introduce them to a ton of offices all in one swoop. So, you know, it's, it's all about making the Leanbox experience a discovery experience. At Leanbox, we're really just trying to change the way the, the American workforce eats. Thanks for checking out this week's innovation video sponsored by Tetra Pak. Subscribe to The Lemper Report to watch more videos just like this. Also, visit supermarketguru.com. Visit becartonsmart.com and you'll see how others are using cartons as a small step to big good.